Hey guys, welcome back to another tutorial video. Today, I'm gonna to be showing you how to change your download location within Steam. So when you download games, they automatically go into a library folder or a Steam library folder uh, that you either told Steam when you created your account or when you installed a new directory or a new drive. So what you're gonna to want to do is log into your Steam account and then go in the upper left-hand corner where you see Steam, click on Steam and then go to settings. Now here under the settings tab here, you want to go down about midway to where you see downloads. And then what we're gonna see is under content libraries, we wanna click on Steam library folders. Now under Steam library folders, this is going to be uh, any drives that you've added. For you, it'll probably be one. For me, it's two, uh, to have games downloaded to. Now there's one that's going to be default, and then there may be others that you can choose from when you're downloading or installing a game. So for me, I have my C drive and my E drive, which I call E Steam Library, and this is my default. So right here, you can see that anytime I you know, purchase and download and install a game, it's going to be installed by default on my E drive. Now, in order for you to change this, all you have to do is make sure that your hard drive is obviously uh, you know, installed in your computer. If it's an external hard drive, it's plugged in via USB, USB-C, whatever the uh, connection type is. And then once it's connected, go to Add Library Folder. And then under Add Library Folder here, you will see a drop-down box here with all of the different drives that you can choose from. So depending on how many SSDs or hard drives you have attached, you can select a new drive here. And then as you can see, I can choose a new F drive. And then what I can do is go to New Folder and then give this a name. So if you want to name this Steam Library 2, uh, if your other drive is full or whatever it may be, and then hit OK, just like this here, uh, and then go to Select. And now as you can see, that folder or directory has been added to your Steam Library folders. Now, in order to make it default, you need to right click and then go to Make Default Folder. This will make it to where whatever you choose or select as your default folder in Steam, that's what things are gonna be automatically downloaded to unless you tell Steam otherwise, okay? So for me, it's my E drive. For you, it may be CD, whatever you wanna call it. It doesn't matter. You just have to give it a, an actual folder within your computer. Now, I'm gonna pull up my folder here on my PC to show you what this looks like. All right, so I'm in my uh, file explorer here on my PC, and then you can see I've gone to my PC and then storage, which is my E drive, it's an SSD drive, and then I have a folder called my Steam library. If I double click on that and then double click on Steam apps, it'll actually show you here, this is where everything will be downloaded to here under this folder within my PC. So once you've added the library folder that you want to change it to, and you have made it your default folder here, you can go ahead and close out of that. So if we go over to our Steam library here, and then we see the different games over on the left-hand side that have not been installed yet, if we select one of those games here, and then we go to install, you can see here that it's automatically going to be installed under our default folder. But if we choose the drop down here, we have the option now to choose that new one that we just created. So by default, it's going to be your default folder, uh, but you can choose to hit the drop down menu here and select the other folders that you've added as well. Now, as far as moving your entire library to a new drive, uh, there's nothing innately in Steam that allows you to do that. You would need to go to your file explorer here and then you would need to just find that folder, which is the Steam library, and drag that over to your new drive. So you would just need to open up a new explorer window here, uh, move it over here, and then find your Steam library, go to that drive that you want to move it to, and then you would just click and select the Steam library, the entire folder, and then move that over to an actual new drive that you want to move the entire library over to. Uh, and then lastly, once you've done that, uh, what you may have to do is go and select the game here, right click, go to properties, and then what you may need to do under local files is you may need to verify integrity of game files. So it may give you an error, but once you've moved the entire library over, uh, it is kind of a pain, but you'll need to right click on the game, go to properties, go to local files, and then verify integrity of game files, and that should verify that it is, uh, you know, you do own the game, uh, it is on a new file or a new directory, and you are good to go. So that's how you mess around and change your uh, download file locations within Steam. If you have any questions about how to do this, please put those in the comment section down below. If this video helped you out, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video.